everyone, Vampire218 here, and welcome back to what is hopefully, or I mean, which what is going to be the last episode in this session of her story. I'm going to continue on her detector, so she took a lie detector test. Test. No, okay, um, pregnant? Oh, here's a lot about pregnant, okay, yeah. Wait. Where's her tattoo? Why is her tattoo not there? Her tattoo is definitely not there. So... When was this taken? Six. Did she get a tattoo from... Well, we'll look into that next. She must have gotten the tattoo afterwards. Because there's... Yeah, because it's like almost a month apart. It's possible she went and got it to two. Won't be sick again. What? Whoa. What? Okay, so she is pregnant. What? He found out on the birthday. Okay. I don't okay. So we're getting this filled in, and that's really what I want to do. We're still missing that big middle bit, though. It's Rapunzel. It's Rapunzel. Ah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Oh. Why is the prince blind? That's really awkward. Yeah. I got an achievement for something. I'll check that after. Oh, that's being awkward. Okay. Rapunzel's story, okay. So... Um... Pregnant... Accident? Yeah, see this... Oh, okay. Okay, so she's talking about Florence. Okay. Oh my god, every time. Okay, so there's something there that we're missing. We're missing quite a bit, though. So, hmm... Throat? Because Simon's throat was cut, he said. Okay, um, here's some stuff. It doesn't look like she has the tattoo there. So, it looks like she must get her tattoo in July. Like I said before, it was three. Yeah, because look, we're in July here, and I believe go to the 27th of July or something. So she must get her tattoo after, the, maybe she could already have it, maybe, on the floor in the living room. 
Wait. But didn't she say something about bags earlier? Unless... Okay. Oh my god, every time! We're getting there. Okay, so something to do with mirror. Um. Okay. Okay. Oh. So. I'm assuming then what happened was, oh, every time. So what I, what it looks like must have happened is Hannah dressed up as Eve. Maybe Eve was seeing Simon though. Um, mirror. Let's look into that. Okay, there's some good stuff here. We got some good stuff. So yeah, here on the first visit, she does not have a tattoo. Okay. Especially for me. So this. I'm not. So she must. Hmm. It feels. The mirror. I can't remember. What? I put it somewhere safe. Oh, she can't remember where she put it. That's interesting. So we learned that he only saw us in the This mirror, it's supposed to be antique. The reflection isn't as good. Yeah, so at this point, her tattoo, I think, it would be up here. Or she could have, like, a band-aid thing on it, maybe. Yeah, so we got some more points in there. Um. Yeah, here we go, because there's, she said something about bags. Oh. Oh, sisters, I have to look up too. I touched the kettle, it was cold. I looked quickly in the living room, nothing. I walked upstairs to the bedroom, he wasn't there. But she's. I didn't search for him because it was pretty clear he wasn't there. I had a shower, the phone rang whilst I was in the shower, I didn't answer it. I think it was Eric. Then what was I was Eric just fellow? Exhausted. So I lay down the mm. bed and fell I woke up a couple of hours later and I was surprised to see no one in the bed next to me. Um, I remembered where I was and what had happened. That's when Eric called Yeah, me. Eric. I to him. Then I called back and rang now. I don't know who they are. And then I decided to come and see you. See you. So maybe. Don't know. Hmm. Oh, this looks like it's a completely separate day, too. This is the first. So 
she definitely. I walked up the house. I knocked on the door. No answer. Oh, oh, what? I my keys out of my bag. I locked the door. The main lock was unlocked. I could tell because the key wouldn't turn when I tried to turn it to the left. I walked in. Simon's coat wasn't on the peg. Um. I couldn't see the shoes on the shoe rack. Um, I shouted out. I walked straight into the kitchen. He usually sits on that half cup of tea with his paper. He wasn't there. I touched the kettle. It was cold. Yeah. Um, I looked quickly into the living room. Nothing. I walked upstairs to the bedroom. He wasn't, wasn't there. there. I didn't search for him because it was pretty clear he wasn't there. And then I had a shower. shower. Whilst I was in the shower, the phone rang. I think it was like his boss. I didn't answer it. Okay. Then I came out and I was just exhausted. So I lay down on the bed and I fell asleep, but I didn't need to. I woke up a couple of hours later and I was surprised to see no one in the bed next to me. And then I remembered where I was and what had happened. That's when Eric called the gun. I spoke to him. Then I called Simon's parents. And then I decided to come and see you. See, only difference, I think, is the Simon's parents part. So let's look up Eric. Oh yeah, we got a lot about Eric. We'll watch these. He was wearing, um, oh, this is really early though. Paddington Bear. Would have taken that with him. It's not in the house. Okay. So he's definitely dead. But this early part maybe they think he she's trying to convince him he's missing I don't know unless So it's Friday evening. We've had a nightmare. Yeah. Um, Eric was in the Okay. Watch these yes, last two. It's the last one we'll watch in this session, I think. Oh no, we got time. We got time for maybe one more search. Eric was like an uncle to him. They were pretty close. They spend a lot of time with each other, especially when they have to go to conferences. We met his wife there. Yeah, see, by the 25th, she d on the 25th, she does not have a tattoo, but then later on, way later on down here, so this is really early, is what it's looking like. The, the one we're on right now is really early in this. But then by down here, she has a tattoo. So what she must have done is, in this big middle period, because I think up here is where she first is like, hey, he's missing. And then, at this point, I think they take her into custody, because then they realize he's dead. And here she must, at this point, be, because they only must they only hold her for, like, what, 48 hours, guys? And then this huge portion here... I think is where they, you know, they must be doing their investigation. She goes and gets our tattoo. And then by this point down here in the bottom, like these bottom four rows, she, she's kind of saying, hey, I'm actually this person. I'm actually Eve. Hannah did do this crime. So, um, sisters. 
sister is going to be the last one we're going to look up here for here. Oh, there's more of that. Oh, we're not going to watch that. We'll watch these and we'll go back to sisters in the next episode. <coughs> okay. Okay. So, yeah, she's actually Eve. She'll be that instant. The look on his face. She, she knew what? That he didn't want her to move in, I guess? She sent him out of the house, kicked him out, called me up, crying, and I went round. I guess I had a feeling. And by this point, she has sure time to go. She called me sister on the phone. She called she me sister. Hmm. Uh! Oh, we're getting this a lot more in the end stuff here. My sister is gone. My sister is gone. What? And she's never coming back. Okay. Well, we have time to watch this. Ugh. Yeah, she is. She looks like she has the tattoo there. No, it's okay. Why did they give her this though? So is she talking about her beach experience where she So I guess Eve's really envious of Hannah. So I guess Eve is the older one, and yeah, because that's what happened in uh, the the thing. Okay. She's a little too happy about this, guys. A little too happy. She's a little too happy about like r murdering her sister. But she says her sister's gone. Does that mean Hannah fled the country or killed herself? It's one of those two. And maybe that's why Eve's there. Because Eve technically didn't do anything wrong. And the... Because Eve didn't, Eve didn't kill her. And if we're assuming that the murder must have happened... Yeah, it's getting really weird for sure. So, okay, well, we got another achievement there. All right, it's gonna be like that, eh? Okay, so, guys, what I'm thinking right now is we are gonna cancel that one. Let me just take a quick look here. Yeah, we're getting a lot of the stuff done. A couple more episodes. So, what I'm, what my, my, my theory right now is that this is Eve. Um, what happens is in the first few lines, Either Hannah killed Simon and fled, and she basically was like, Hey, sister, please do this for me, uh, whatever. Uh, Hannah is the younger sister, and so Eve wanted to like kind of protect her, even though Hannah had the good life. So, 
Hannah kills Simon because she's really mad because maybe Simon fell in love with Eve or something. And then in this middle bit, because Hannah was the one who killed him, Hannah flees um, Eve, because this is right after she gets brought in. Eve gets a tattoo. And then a little bit later on, she comes back. She has her tattoo, and she's like, you know, I am actually Eve. That's my name. You, you call me in the lie detector test. Here's what's going on. My sister has fled the country and so that she doesn't get in, like, super big trouble. That's what I'm thinking, guys. Anyway, I've been Vampire Tweeteen. Hopefully you enjoyed this and you're enjoying the series and we'll find out what happens next time. Bye.